Ukrainian airspace has been closed to all civilian aircrafts, and the Eastern European countries are now monitoring their airspace carefully. In the latest, Moldova, southwest of Ukraine, has banned commercial flights, while Belarus has said that civilian planes could no longer fly over part of its territory. The map on your screen now shows a total blackout of the Ukraine airspace after a number of countries issued guidelines prohibiting their airlines from overflying Ukrainian airspace. In the latest, the United Kingdom has banned all Russian aircrafts from flying in British airspace. Czech Republic, Poland and Bulgaria have also prohibited Russian flights from entering their airspace. The step comes in response to Russian invasion of Ukraine. On Friday, Polish airline lot had already halted flights to Moscow and St. Petersburg. Czech Republic announced that the country was halting the traffic of all Russian airline companies in Czech airspace. Polish Prime Minister Mateusz Morawiecki said that the country was going to take similar decisions. Bulgaria followed suit to show solidarity with Ukraine. Ministry of Transport said Russian aerospace may no longer enter sovereign Bulgarian airspace, including over its territorial waters. On Thursday, UK government had announced a ban on Russian flagship carrier Aeroflot. Moscow quickly responded by banning all UK-linked planes, including transiting flights from Russian airspace. Meanwhile, Moldova has also closed its airspace. Flights are being redirected to other airports. Meanwhile, UN's civil aviation body has condemned violation of Ukraine's airspace after Russian invasion. In a statement, the body said that the invasion violates Article 1 of the Chicago Convention, which established the ICAO, or the ICAO, as well as the rules of airspace rights and air travel and security. The International Civil Aviation Organization Council has 36 member states. The council has urged Russia to cease its unlawful activities to ensure the safety and security of civil aviation in all affected areas. It also called upon Russia to respect its obligations under international air laws. ICAO is not a global regulator and does not have the power to impose sanctions. It is a forum for states to set international aviation standards. Meanwhile, countries are using alternative routes via neighboring nations to evacuate their citizens. An Air India Boeing aircraft, which departed from Mumbai for Romanian capital Bucharest today to bring back Indian citizens stranded in Ukraine, is expected to arrive later today. We on is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.